Hi guys and welcome to my channel. This is Becoming Kate. I am so excited to be with you today because I am going to be reviewing some glasses that I got from iBuyDirect. Now I am not sponsored nor do they pay me for this kind of stuff, but I thought because I would go on the website and I'd be looking around wondering which glasses should I get? How do they look on people like me? So here is a quick little review of the four glasses that I have bought from iBuyDirect that I absolutely actually really love. I have worn glasses since literally the fifth grade. So I know good glasses, okay? So let's just get started and yeah, let's pop into that. Okay, these are my St. Mitchell frames. These are probably the ones I wear the most often, but I like these a lot because they're fairly simple. Now on the website, it looked like they were gonna be really gold, which is what I really wanted, was something that was like super gold. Um, but they kind of came out this like off gold, like almost like brassy kind of color, which I don't hate. I just wish that I had known that there were other types of gold within the gold, I don't know, the options I guess that you can get. Like I said, I don't hate, I just wish that they were super, super gold. And I've seen other people's that look a lot more gold than mine. So I'm just not sure if it was something I did. Maybe they got my order wrong. I don't know, but I kept them because I needed glasses. These also have the blue light lenses in them, which for me have been so helpful because I'm an editor. I do a lot of things on the computer. I'm a filmmaker, so I'm constantly looking at screens. So this is what they look like on. Um, they're a very simple frame. I really like wireframes. The only thing that I don't like is that you can see, you see the, the glare on there? Yeah, you can see that on my glasses. But other than that, they're amazing. Like, I don't really mind that too much. It's not really a big deal. Whatever, you know? Um, but yeah, so this is something that I think might work for a lot of different face shapes. But for me, I love them. So thank you, I buy direct for that. Moving on, moving on. So, this is a newer pair that I got, um, which I wasn't sure about at first. These babies are called Palo Alto. So they are a very, very minimalistic frame. There is no, like the only part of the frame that you can see really when it's on my face is this no the nose bridge here and then the place that goes around your ears. Um, which is, you know, I thought at the time when I was buying them, I was like, oh, this is cool, you know, different. It looked good on a lot of different people. When I first put them on, I didn't like them so much, but after a while they have grown on me and they've become something that I think is kind of cool. Um, like I said, they're very low profile, so you can't really see them on my face. These do not have any blue light in them. They're just straight lenses. So they have a green glare instead of the blue. Um, I did order them in a large, like my St. Mitchell's are also in a large, but I ordered these in a large um, because I feel like, although I am a small person, I have a very, um, small, but like a little bit wide of a face, you know, like around, like my eyes are kind of close together, but then my face is kind of like wide square. So when I wear certain glasses, like they either look really, really large on me or they look really tiny. So these, I think, like I said, you can barely see them, but I think they have a really nice size. I really like oversized frames and I'm getting used to them. I think they're kind of cool. What do we know? We're turning into adult people. I don't know, I just feel like an adult when I wear these. I feel really smart. <laughs> okay, next pair. Um, something to note is I have a negative three, negative 2.75 or 2.25 um, glasses prescription. I also have an astigmatism in my negative three eye, which is my right eye. So a lot of times, like I said, glasses online, it doesn't really work out until eye by direct. So if you're thinking that, oh, I don't know if mine's gonna work, just make sure you really have your pupillary distance measured correctly. Cause to me, that's been the most essential thing and getting glasses that fit. All right, now the next two pairs. Now my St. Mitchell's actually came in this case, not the ones that I'm about to show you in here. Um, but I really like these frames. These are literally my new favorite frames. These are my babies. And I've been wanting them for so long because on the website, they're like kind of expensive, but totally worth it. These are called the Alchemist frame and they have this really cute tortoiseshell um, detailing around the outside of the lens, which I love. I think that's such a cute minimalist, but and clean detail that nose bridge and the arms are actually really gold. 
and super, super cute. And I think that it looks really good. And the, the arms also have tortoise shell on them in the back there. Yeah. I'm putting them on so you can see them. I think they are just so smart. Like they are just so cute and so smart. They just take you in the smart land. Like you're like, I do computer stuff. I don't know. I might be the alchemist myself, maybe. I don't know. Well, these have blue light on them. Now, however, these have, you see the green on there? Yeah, but they're also tinted yellow. So these are, I got these, these were pretty expensive the way I got them done. They have uh, one of the most expensive uh, blue light filters on them because although I love my St. Michael, the St. Mitchells, um, these really like, I can go hours on the computer and I don't feel nothing because the blue light is so strong. And as you can see, the glare is not as bad. So if you're thinking about the Alchemist frames, it's what they look like on a little black girl who is feeling cute, feeling herself, okay? And lastly, I love these as well. I, I really love all the frames I got, guys. I really do. I think they're all really cute. Um, the last frames I got are these, which I am calling, what are they called? Aura. These are called Aura. They're part of the Reflect line, um, which is like a minimalist line from iBuy Direct, but they have really, really cool frames. These are not blue light. They're just plain. Um, I'll hold them up so you can see them. But I got them in champagne. So they're like a clear frame, but then they have a little bit of color to them in brown or like a tanny color, which I'm like all about. So I really like those. I think these are like really nice, sturdy frames. And these definitely are a frame that I think would look good on multiple faces. They're really cute, really sweet looking. You could dress them up, dress them down. Really, really nice. Uh, and very, very sturdy. I really like these. I think that they're a fun, cute um, change to like the clear frames trend that was going around. Uh, yeah, I just think that they like dress it up just a bit. They make it a little more mature. So yeah, I really like them. I think they're really cute. Ordering some glasses from I Buy Direct, I definitely, definitely recommend them. I think that all of their glasses, I, I don't know, I've only purchased four of them, but you get points for being in their rewards program, which is really cool. And you constantly are getting like little perks and stuff, you know, depending on which level you're at, like the perks go up, you're gonna get things for your birthday, you're getting things for all the holidays, there's always a discount going on. So you're not ever gonna really honestly have to pay full price for glasses anymore. <laughs> Cause you know, for me, glasses used to be so expensive. So I'm just grateful that I can purchase from them and get something that makes me feel confident and happy in my glasses. So I hope this helped you guys a little bit um, in decision making with some of the popular frames there. The four that I got are pretty popular, so I went pretty safe, but you know, maybe you're feeling brave. Maybe you wanna tag me and let me know what you bought. I would love to hear. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you later. Bye.